is absolutely wonderful to have that continued support. All right, so we've got we've got Dorian, we've got Blackwall right now. We have Varric. So I am looking at switching out Blackwall for Iron Bull. I think we want to keep Dorian. Do I keep Varric or do I grab another warrior though? That's my question. Also, add to the count now that I know Twitch is watching. <laughs> yes. Because we, we already do the roguey thing. So maybe we'll add... Let's add Cassandra and see how that changes our party dynamics. I like running around with Farrick, but I wanna I wanna kinda play with the party dynamic and see what we can do here. Alright, so main goal main goal for today. Because I don't want to like we've got a lot of stuff that we need to get done. But the main goal for today is going to be collecting shards. In Exalted Plains. Alrighty, so let's run a prediction here. Maybe. Hello. Why... Why do you make it narrow like this? There we go. Prediction! Done. Not to put magic sheep out of a job, but you could make just requesting village well a gamble like Two does with the Egg World Shrine. That's true, and I've thought about doing that. Um, I kind of like giving it a personal flair, but we can also automate it. Yes. I, I really like... Um, the narrations that Magic Sheep has come up with, I want to see where it goes, because it's wonderful. And it's fun to see the the writing style and stuff. Um, but I also want to make sure that I am not overtaxing my mods with this, this new thing. So, um, I think at some point we will probably automate it. Um, but for now, it's a really fun, it's a really fun in the moment kind of thing. I, I am enjoying it. Just write a hundred narrations and, and then program their in, them in. How hard could it be? Right? Like, how hard could it be? Honestly. Right? <laughs> no? No, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna keep track of the shards. I'm gonna get distracted. Have an AI. Oh my god, have an AI write all of them. Oh my god. That could be that could be such a mess. That would be crazy. I wonder if there's a D and D narration. Maybe I'll make that my capstone. Ooh, there you go.
All right, we have one. Aye. We gotta loot all the things, of course. What is this? What are you? It looks like a weird combination between a pig and an anteater. What are you? Also, the video game conventions of stuff that's burning just stays burning. I do love that, right? Right? Ah, there's a there's a ladder over here so that I can climb onto this burning roof. How useful. I'm so glad I'm up here to loot this chest where it's burning. To get this enchanter coat schematic. Don't worry, it won't collapse, right? <laughs> Or depending on how many channel point slots you have, you can make set certain percentage chance ones. A um, thousand, twenty-five percent, two thousand, five, uh, fifty percent. Ooh, that's true. So we could do maybe some different versions. I'm also looking at streamer bot. Um, I sat down with our lovely friend Pow SRC, and uh, we were talking about streamer bot and some of the cool stuff that you can get out of out of the the AI and it does a lot of good stuff um, but I am definitely not like prepared to just sit down and play with it there is so much to that program and I I just I sit down and I look at it and I get overwhelmed um, so at some point here I'm going to have to figure out how to utilize it because there is just so much to it and I feel like it could consolidate a bunch of the stuff that I want to put onto the channel I just don't know how to capitalize on it yet because there's stuff that I've been wanting to do with trigger fire and cruise control and just all kinds of different things and I feel like streamer bot can do all of those things just all in one and I, I look at the program and I'm just like, I don't know how to make this do what I want it to do. But I, I want to do those things. So I've got to figure out how to do the thing. And if I could set aside the time to just spend eight hours watching how-to videos and messing with the program and messing with my channel and that kind of stuff, it would be so much easier. But, uh, that has yet to happen. So, I gotta figure out what we can do here. I love that even though I have Iron Bull set to defend me, he still just rushes straight in there and is like, no, I beat the thing. This is my job. I wish to fight all of the things. The best defense is a good offense. Iron Bull definitely thinks that. Also, for any of my lovely subscribers who did not yet see it this morning over on the Discord, there is a poll for all subscribers and Patreon supporters um, to let me know who you would like Greyfort to romance for this playthrough, because I swear this has been my most commonly asked question. People want to know who we're romancing for this playthrough. 
Um, there's five options that are mechanically available in the game. So if you would like to get your word in. He's going to be our bay, Iron Bull. You think so? Where did all of my incidental sound go? Hello? My, my audio just cut out for some reason. Look, it's the most important question in the whole RPG. Is it? Is that what it is? There we go. I don't know what just happened, but... Suddenly, all of my audio just disappeared, except for the walking sounds. I don't know what was going on there. Very strange. Got alert for work. Today is meetings day again. We'll pop back in and out as I can. Purple Kara, thank you very much for the lurk. Appreciate you hanging out in the background, even if you can't be in chat. Honestly, keeping that window open, as long as you haven't muted the stream... It is amazingly helpful. Do, 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 do. Why was there a rip? Did you see that rift just pop up? What the heck? Hello? Let's take a look. Uh, yeah, okay. There we go. Fight the rift with my own rift powers. <laughs> ah. How did I end up here? Excuse me. I did not ask to be pulled towards my opponent. Nobody told me that wasn't an option. What? No, thank you. And a landmark. Ville Montevelen. Ville Montevelen was the first settlement humans established in the Dales following the victory of the Exalted March. Soldiers were the earliest residents of the village. In 221 Glory, Sister Amity, champion of the Exalted March, laid the foundation stones of the village chantry in a symbolic gesture. The building's construction was completed by 222. Laying aside her sword and bow, Sister Amity took a to the task of leading Ville Montevelin's flock, becoming revered Mother Amity. She served the Maker for over 40 years, ministering to both residents of the Dales and the many pilgrims of the historic site. Revered Mother Amity died peacefully in her sleep in 264. Her ashes are interred in the Chantry's vault, where dozens of pilgrims still come each year to pay their respects. We are near something here. Old journal. An old journal, clearly much beloved. 
I weep at what the armies have done. Ditches scar the landscape. There's fire everywhere. All around is the smell of bitter smoke and spilled blood. I remember coming here as a boy. It was late summer, and the plains were bright and golden. The earth was warm and felt like home. All that's gone. My mother said my father was from these parts. She never told anyone but me that he was an elf. Maybe part of me, the elf-blooded part, feels what the Dalish felt for the centuries. This is my home. I would give anything to preserve it. I'll go now with the others, but when the war is over, I will return. It will be beautiful again. What am I looking for here? Ah, there we go. Gray whiskey, right wine, conscription ale. A bottle marked vintage Warren Cornick. Notes of fruit and anger. I feel like that would be a good cologne description. Um, I don't know if anybody follows Black Phoenix Alchemy Lab, which is one of my favorite perfumers. Um, but they do a lot of like nerdy stuff. They have a bunch of themed perfumes. I've been following their company since I was in college. Great, we're gonna drown here. Because I can't get back up this stupid riverbank. <laughs> Why is there not a fence here, dev team? Why do I just have to drown in the river? Can you explain to me why I'm just stuck in the river now? Fine. Rude! Rude. In-game village well, apparently. Jeez. Uh, what was I doing? Oh, there's a shard nearby. That's the hissing that we're hearing. That, like, hissing chime. I don't know how I'm gonna get up there, though. Do I have to, like, get onto the wall, like, over here? And then go across the wall? Maybe that's how. Okay, maybe we go this way. Alright. I go over here. No, no, don't. Don't fall. What am I standing on? I'm not standing on anything. Cool. Awesome. So then we have to start over. Iron Bull, you're, you're in the way, buddy. You're in the way. Thank you. Ah! Alright. There we go. There we go. Hey! We figured it out. Nice. Very nice. Alright. What else we got over here? We did that. We should grab these landmarks while we're here. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. I wish I could, like, somersault off things. Why is this game not Assassin's Creed? Where I can just do fancy jumps off of things and stuff. Come on now. I don't care that it's a different game studio. I want I want my fancy jumps and stuff. Ah! Ah! Why are you attacking me from over here? Excuse me. Seven out of ten. Not Assassin's Creed, right? Right? I am, however, thinking about potentially playing some Assassin's Creed on stream. Since it is one of my favorite franchises. Seems like it might be a good time. And especially since I want to be doing a cosplay for Assassin's Creed, or a blended with Assassin's Creed, might be a good time. Memorials of the Second Exalted March. 
triumph of the light. Remember the triumph over the profane. Sister Amity led the march to the river Tensair, where it stood shrines to the elven gods. These she struck down, standing upon the banks. She sang the chant of light. Andraste's word had become had come to the dales and delivered them from wickedness. What is what is this? I don't know what this banner location is. I don't remember seeing one of those on the map before. Oh, those are cool! Almost every Orlesian noble keeps a winter home in the Dales. It's a mark of status. Ooh, can I... Can I use dynamic camera as a photo mode? Is there a photo mode? I don't think there's a photo mode in this game. Yeah, see, even even when I turn off the HUD, the dynamic camera still has... No photo mode? When did this game come out? Uh, like 10 years ago. <laughs> like 10 years ago. It's been, it's been a... A hot minute. <laughs> that was prime photo mode time? Pontagur. A plaque on the bridge of Pontagur reads, Dedicated to all, elven and human, who lost their lives in the Second Exalted March. Pontagur was built a hundred years after the Exalted March of the Dales. It was named for Mayor Agur of Ville Montevillian, who raised the money to have the bridge built after several villagers drowned in a ferry accident, trying to cross the river, swollen after the rains. Some villagers took offense at the dedication message on the bridge, which honors fallen elves as well as humans. Rumors that the mayor was elf-blooded began circulating. He was forced to step down. <sighs> that sounds familiar. Uh, I think we have some level ups here for our characters, maybe? Yes, Cassandra has two points to spend. The farther you lunge before striking your target, the more damage you do to them. Or, if lunge and slash strikes an enemy that was not attacking you, the ability refunds the cost of the cooldown. More lunge... more often. I feel like more often is going to be better for our action economy.
Why is he back to follow? Okay. That explains some things. All right. So Iron Bull is focusing on large weapons here. Ooh, he has a barbarian tree. That's cool. I didn't even know that was an option. Unlock operation. That's convenient. Someone can fix this, right? One would hope. Do do do. What am I doing? Uh, ooh, there's a camp over here. Let's establish our other camp. And then we go back to hunting shards. Do, 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 do. One would think that that is not a particularly difficult goal today. 16 items to find in-game over a six-hour span. Uh, but y'all know me. Y'all have been here. I get distracted, okay? Immediately runs off to the side to go collect something. Look. <laughs> this is how this works, okay? This is just this is just my brain. And we are on the wrong side of this ridge. It could have been one of 16 things you had to check. I know, right? Right? You gotta check. It's the same reason I search empty containers in Skyrim. I gotta check that it's empty. I just... I gotta check that it's empty, okay? Somebody might have missed something. Also... I don't know if I have a... I don't have a command handy, but I checked it this morning and Dixper is working today. So if y'all want to continue to mess with me some more today, you are able to. Also, I mentioned this a few days ago, but it's been a little bit. Um, there is a new pack. Thank you, Magic Sheep. Appreciate you. There's a new uh, Dixper skill pack that is available called the Control Pack. And it has a card in it for um, modifying my controller response. So it like mixes up my controller buttons. It's kind of the same way as like flip. Uses Dixper to keep turning on track. I mean... If you can figure out how to do that, I'm here for it. <sighs> um, but yeah, so there's a there's a new skill that I found in one of the other games that will mess with my controller. What is this? Can I get into here? Inquisition soldiers could clear this passage. Nice. I'm guessing that those are like on the the war table or something. Can I not get to that campsite until I clear that passage? Is that going to be the thing? Hey! Hey! You stole my mouse! You stole my mouse? No, I didn't sign up for this. Deft hand just finds tools.
Can't search for random things if you don't have your mouse, obviously. Obviously. Where's that campsite? I have a feeling that we're not going to be able to get to the campsite. Ah! The villager noises. Stand your ground. Immediately jumps backwards. Good. Yes. Alright, there's a there's a draugr standing here, but for some reason it's not attacking. Excuse me? Excuse me, sir. Beard. Save! We have not saved yet. We're still under attack though, apparently. Exclamation. Bard from the other side. Well, that's useful. How am I supposed to enter the thing? There you are. I was waiting for that. But it's... There we go. I was like, why is it not... So helpful. Alright. Now I can save. Very good. There's so much running. But I never feel like there's enough cause to, like, actually get out the... the horse? Because there's the horse, like, fast travel component, right? But I never feel like there's enough cause to do the, the fast travel. We need this ring velvet for. <gasps> do, do, do. Also, what makes, excuse me, what makes it different? 
What makes ring, ring velvet a different sort of velvet? I'm really tempted to start getting into cabinetry because I have an obsession with freaking medieval fantasy a rift hello and gaslamp fantasy and apparently that means that I need little reliquaries for everything so of course I want to get into cabinetry and container making Because of course I do. <laughs> Running around, killing demons, closing rifts, and Cherny goes, I need to get into cabinetry. Iconic. Yes. These are my <laughs> these are my thoughts. Just, you know, calmly making some stuff. This is my whole brain, though. This is why I wonder if I have ADHD, because, like, I will be in the middle of something very involved. And I will be on the side having very calm thoughts about completely unrelated things. And it's just... Like, why? Why is that where my brain is? I am in a horrible place. I took damage. And now I am not stealthy. There we go. This is a very tough rift. But yeah, I think it'd be really fun. Like one of the one of the things that I know that I can do without having to like learn a whole bunch of brand new skills and get a bunch of new tools is what I would like to do is set aside a little bit of money and get some like pre-built boxes and stuff. Ranger Sheeb! Hello, Ranger Sheeb. Welcome in. We will hydrate. Thank you very much for the hydrate. But there's, like, you go to the hobby store, you can get pre-built boxes and stuff um, that are made out of, you know, soft pine. They're pretty cheap, but they're not a bad way to start for doing stuff like that, you know? They're not a bad way to... Does Ranger Sheep need to hydrate too? We do all the hydrates. Whoa! Hello? What happened to my ram? Ranger Sheep is getting sick! Oh no! Sketch of Evanoris River. I hope he feels better soon. Is is he getting what you had like two weeks ago? I always like to make tea when I'm starting to feel sick. We think just two weeks is a long incubation. Yeah. Well, also, think about it. He was probably fighting it off the whole time. So, like...
Never mind, eight more minutes. <laughs> yes. What just happened? Did, so Did you all see that? This place saw some hard fighting. Did did you see the wolf like get thrown up above my head and then just explode in midair? Like what? What is this game? Hello? What are you doing? What are you doing over here, Stream Deck? It's not time for that. Go back. Good grief. What am I over here for? What am I doing? I was doing something over here and then I saw the wolves. Oh, this guy. I needed to go back here and catch that guy. I, I went past it. Dang it. Alright. See? We're only halfway there and I got completely lost. But yes, I, I'm thinking about being able to do some, like, handmade, refinished, like, keepsake boxes. That kind of thing, maybe. I think that could be super cool. Um, I would love to actually make them at some point, but I gotta get started somewhere. Leaked Prism, you have returned! What did you have for food? That, that's that's my question. What did you have for food? <laughs> We're on the wrong side of this separation here, this valley. <sighs> also, I'm already hungry. Pork goulash with tagalatel? Tagalatel? I don't know what that is. I mean, like, I understand goulash. Goulash is pretty simple. Um, I grew up in... Thick, flat pasta. Oh, okay. How... how... What? What am I fighting? How similar to, like, lasagna noodles is it? Or is it more like egg noodles, but thick? <gasps> like dense. I'm assuming that there are pits that I need to set on fire here. Like there were at the other location. Path of Flame. What are we fighting? There we go. Ow. You just got knocked How did I get knocked prone? Also, Dorian, how did you get up here? Like that, I guess. All right. Is 
There should be a ladder somewhere. Here we go. Tipsy Tiger! Thank you so much for the tier two. Being subscribed for eight months. My goodness, has it been that long? Also, where is my where's my notification? Excuse me. Excuse me, OBS. What are we doing here? Why are my alerts not working? Excuse me? Do the thing, please. A tipsy tiger, thank you very much for the resub. I greatly appreciate it. It's wonderful to have you here. And thank you so much for being a Forge member at Tier 2. Appreciate that additional support. It means a lot. There we go. Deep mushroom. Also, that does not look like a mushroom. That looks like some kind of beast. The stream is not loading for me at the office, but I just got out of my meeting. Congratulations! Congratulations, you have escaped your meeting. I hope it was good. Yeah, doesn't this look like a creature of some kind? Oh, a belt of healing. Bottles of Thetis. Alvarado's bathtub boot screech. If you can read this, you haven't drunk it. Uh oh. Sounds dangerous. Ooh, we got some bloodstone though. That's useful. Is there anything up in this tower? No. Also, apparently that stairwell was steep enough that it was difficult for us to climb, which I find hilarious. The whole reason behind a stairwell is so that it is not difficult to climb. Ah! Why are you right here on top of me? No. No, goodbye, sir. Goodbye. Where the heck? There it is. Alright, are we good? I think we're good. And we have more shards to find. Dang it. Or no. Okay. We've done this one already. Good. I was like, no, I don't want to have to find more of them. My attention span is already bad enough. I don't know what, what am I pinging off of. 
Oh, the ocularium? Maybe? That's fine, I guess. I don't know how we're supposed to, like, restore this place. Maybe we're not supposed to. I don't know. Anyway. On to the next shard. I suppose. But yes, for any any of our subscribers, if you haven't seen it yet, we do have that poll in the subscriber chat in the Discord. So you can weigh in as to who you would like us to romance. We have a level up. No? Okay. I guess not. The Desolate Bank. It's very pretty. I wonder what's off to the north there. Can we get there once we, like, open the Pontagur... Uh... Bridge, maybe? Yeah, this campsite looks like it's way in between... ...and, like, behind... ...these gates. <laughs> 